Today we are going to finishing our Saber build with our last component, the hard drive. We got our 1080 Ti and then also the RAM. I got the RAM. I originally thought this was a 3.5 inch drive. I don't know if you guys can see that. So nevertheless, we're going to go ahead and open up the back of the, build, uh, the PC here. Just go ahead and move this and make sure that I am in frame. No biggie, no biggie. I'm away with the glass. I'm just going to put this on my seat over here. And I gotta find my connections in here. Okay, so I found the I found the connector. So let's go ahead and try and plug her in. Man, it's it's really tight. I don't know if it's meant to be this tight. I don't know if it's. Let me just. Ah! Damn it. Okay, so. In my attempt to, in my attempt to try and force on my connector here, I have only gone ahead and broken my hard drive. That is, that is completely, that is snapped in half. I knew the damn connector was too. In me trying to put on this connector here, I pushed down on it and it bent. And I tried, it, it didn't seem to want to go on, so I pushed harder, and I've only gone and bent it forward. And now there is just this big gap right here. And the entire thing is now for the scrap. <sighs> this is a door that we are planning to put back on. We're doing small modifications to it. I will hold this piece here. Just how easily it goes through on speed one. With a simple, that's them off. Now that is factory put on. I put no pressure whatsoever on that. That's them off. So nevertheless, let's go ahead and put it back on. That's it in. Simple as that. We also have these two holes here. Barely any pressure. And, oh, I went a little far with that one there. There we go. And there you I didn't mean to go through the front. Um, maybe I could put the screws in on the other side and it'll kind of give it a flatter look. And today I have a very special video for you guys. If you want to make a slime at home and you don't know how, you can just watch this video and learn from me. I have this bowl right here. It's the first one, a bottle of water. Pour the water. The second thing is I've chosen this shower gel and just pour just just a bit just just enough amount of shower gel next one we're gonna need this hair gel you just have to shake it a bit pour it all in like like this a shaving cream i'm gonna push it okay it's the next thing is not really needed it's the rum this will help us kind of okay the next thing is just two spoons of sugar pour in i think this will make a great slime so why not this should be a slime by now, but what the heck? Like, it should be slimy. It's not even slimy, it's just liquid. Well, maybe it needs some more sugar. Like, one more. Yeah, this should be enough, right? Because uh, the sugar makes things thicker, right? Well, nah. Uh, okay. It looks like a freaking drink, to be honest. It just looks like a soup. Now, I personally come from a relatively well-off family. We were one of the viewers to be waiting for the cyber truck. Personally, I know that a lot of people don't like the look of the truck. I know that personally, I don't mind it at all. I think it's very unique. I think that it's quite futuristic. I'm also going to actually show you me purchasing one. I got a bank transfer through from my mother's account to my account about three days ago, and this is going to be my first car. I can't lie. It's grown on me. Okay guys, here is the cyber truck. Enter personal details.
And let's place the order. Man, am I excited. What? There's an issue with your payment. Let me get onto my bank real quick. I can't log in. Give me one second, guys. I'm gonna go and ring my bank here. Hi, uh, yeah. Um, I think there might be an issue with my card. I don't know if maybe something went on my account. Could you check it for me? Yeah, the number is uh five seven one nine six. And and where was where was this um login? Asia. Nothing to have maybe have called me when you. Maybe you should have rang me. Bring me to your fraud department then. That wasn't authorized. Oh, I don't know how this information. You're the head of security, so what am I meant to say to you? You don't know how it got out. I don't know how. Put me onto the fraud department so I can request it. No, I'm not going to take down my. I have over three hundred thousand taken out of my account. Unauthorized purchase that you should have been monitoring. I really did want to purchase this today, but it looks like there was an, an incorrect login attempt or something from Indonesia because I haven't got such a large transfer before, like 300,000 plus. Basically, they flagged the payment and thought that it was incorrect, but basically, there's nothing I can do. The money has been put through to the frauds claim. I should get this amount back. It shouldn't be me that loses this because that was their fault, but still, I now can't buy this. So. Spit on the hands. Get that grip. All right, guys. Turn the camera off. Turn it off. It's minus 45 degrees right now. And I'm gonna be going outside to pack snow. Ничего не получилось. 